day. Today is Thursday, March 10th, 2022. I'm Dave Blanchard, Marco Well, peace had a little bit of a bounce yesterday. Unfortunately, didn't even take out the two-day high. And unfortunately, too, futures getting whacked pre-market. So we could give up a sizable portion of those gates, at least on the open. If you don't know anything about markets, just pay attention to this Landry light, meaning that the highs or less than a 30 EMA, or use your favorite, 50 simple, works pretty good too. That'll help to keep you on the right side of the market. Notice that it's done a pretty good job in the NASDAQ. One little kiss here, and then right back down. As you can see, NASDAQ bounced too a little bit yesterday, but nothing to get excited about, at least just yet. Let's take a look at the Rusty. Rusty had a little bit of a bounce too, pushing back toward that 30 EMA. Again, nothing magical about that, but it can help to keep you on the right side of the market. Rusty's been consolidating in here, so we'll have to pay attention to see if it can rally off those lows. For now, though, the trend remains down. Energy's pulling back a little bit, look pretty good longer term. Metals and mining, same sort of action going on there too, actually ended higher at the end of the day. Most other areas though remain in pretty serious downtrend. So what do we do? Well, continue short weakness and buy strength. There's not a whole lot of strength, by the way. <laughs> Any questions, as usual, DaveDaveLander.com. Ooh, ooh, chart show tonight. Hope to see you there. Go to DaveLander.com to register.